give you a quick little update on the two bolts that I've processed now um, from the printer. We've got another six on their way. Um, so these two were actually meant to arrive to me by the 14th of January and I got them within a couple of days of them being shipped off. So um, if that's anything to go by, I think the other six bolts should be here within a few days, which is awesome. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys what I have been up to. Um, so we've got our panels on the top shelf, we've got our knit panels and our woven panels. Um, there are more panels to come, that's just what's come so far. And also we've got our, on this shelf that I showed you, we've got our wovens and that's what's come so far. I think there might be a couple more snuck into um, a couple of the other bolts, but this is probably the majority of the woven. So much baby shark woven that you guys ordered. Um, and our glitters, wasn't heaps of them ordered, but um, I think they're probably gonna be used as cords with the others. And, um, and then we've got our beautiful, beautiful, my favorite, I think of this whole round is the Mint Summer Hummingbirds. And this one's on the 220 GSM Cotton Micra. Um, and we've also got below that, what's come so far of our swim knit. So we have three of our glitters. And as we know, there are five because there's a dark purple and a gold that are to come. Um, oh, we've also got our peach skin and minky and um, what else? Oh, the 180 GSM, the 260 GSM. So that's all still to come. They're still on the other bolts. Um, but yeah, of the swim knit, this is what's come so far. Um, and of course, we've got the one we were talking about before, which is meant to be the mint hummingbirds, which I'm probably going to have to rename this one as teal hummingbirds. I'm not really sure. Um, not many of you guys actually ordered this one. So I think it's only like 2.5 metres of this was ordered by you guys. But I ordered, um, I think it's like 10 metres or something of this um, to put up for retail. So, um, but yeah, it's come out really, really pretty. I can do a comparison. Just hold on a sec. I'll try not to wobble the camera. So this is the woven mint hummingbirds, which is very, very true to how I designed it next to how it came out on swim. So when you're printing on swim, um, your blues and your darker colors just really, really pop out. Um, so as a hairdresser, I look at that the same, the same logic as when you're putting a color, a bright color over lighter hair, it comes out brighter. So when you're um, printing onto spandex, because the base is just so much brighter and whiter, um, and the, I guess the canvas of the fabric is different too and the, the method in which they print onto it is different. So the fabric um, absorbs, I guess, the fabric, uh, the ink differently. So when you're printing onto your natural fibres, um, it absorbs a lot of the colour and when you're printing onto your non-natural fibres, it reflects a lot of that colour. So um, I'm actually really stoked with how that came out. Um, the other thing that we were talking about in the group today. It was Baby Shark. I'll just swing on over to Baby Shark. And so we've got a bolt here of 30 meters, counted and rolled back onto the bolt. My girls helped me do that today. Um, yeah, so this is the Baby Shark on swim. And this is the tiny little piece of Baby Shark on Cotton Lycra that has come so far there's stacks more I think it's like 40 more meters to come of this one so that's probably got an entire bolt to itself um, so yeah so this is the side-by-side -side comparison of the two so I just wanted to to clear up or to clarify um, I don't know that anyone was worried but I just wanted to um, yeah just to to clear up if anybody was um, confused as to why you know this one was paler and this one was darker or um, bolder. Um, the reason is that, again, like I said, because on spandex you do you get those crisper lines and the colours just stand out from the fabric more. Um, the cotton light grey is not quote unquote paler in the sense that it came out wrong or anything like that. This is exactly how we did it on the strike offs. The only difference I made was I whitened, the, I brightened the whites because the whites were. I don't know if any of you noticed it. Um, they were a bit yellowed and um, weren't standing out as much. So all I did was on 
and it's the same file, the printer used the same file to print both of these, um, I whitened his eyes so that he stood out more. Um, and the eyes of the little fish as well because they were just a tad yellow and they didn't look that pretty. So um, that's all we did to touch that up. And the strike offs though, this is what they looked like on here. Um, I did make a change to the strike off panel. So this is just my sample piece that the printer sent to me. Um, the panels, the actual panels haven't yet come. But um, again, remember the other day I said to you that I had to put two dark waves behind Baby Shark because you just couldn't see him. He was disappearing into the background. So I made that change. Um, and then when we get the swim panels of Baby Shark, it's going to, again, it's going to be bold and it's going to pop like that but please don't think for a second that you know it's come out um, less quality than, than what it had for the strike offs or that it didn't work or anything like that so it's not a floor it's not paler it's not wrong it's just that when you print on the cotton micro your colors do come out paler um, than when you print on swim so um, I think it's something that's probably going to come up um, from time to time as we do rounds of people are going to query with my bright colors um, you know we're doing um, pushing um, next and we'll have the same thing when we print onto spandex people will wonder why is you know the spandex brighter and bolder that's just the nature of it so I think I'll probably put a bit of a disclaimer a clear disclaimer on the website um, just so people are aware when you're buying spandex it's going to be brighter um, so yeah oh I want to show you I have this here so this is the cotton lycra um, watermelon stripes and this is the swim watermelon stripes I'm down here in the corner I don't know if you can see it really well but like that's the difference between printing on cotton lycra and printing on swim knit or spandex. You just get a difference in just the way that it, that it comes out. But at the end of the day, we're not going to be um, pairing any of our cotton lycras with our swim. So it's not like you're going to you know, have a mismatch of colours or anything like that. Um, yeah, I just wanted to clarify that because I didn't want anybody worrying that, you know, maybe I hadn't, um, you know, done the right thing or whatever but yeah so that's where we're at at the moment I'm waiting on the rest of the six bolts um, I ordered some minky of these um, and glitters and stuff because none of you guys had ordered it and I really want to know what it looked like so I've ordered some and they'll probably go up for retail as well um, but I'm half expecting the minky to come out looking like the darker one there so that'd be really interesting to see what happens so anyway if you guys have got any questions um just comment below let me know what you think and uh, also if anybody's wanting to add to their order when the retail goes live just shoot me a message um just a private message you don't have to do it through the um Sotopia page you can just send it to me um privately because i get them easier that way um just to let me know that you want me to hold your order i've had a couple of you already ask me to do that so i'm more than happy to hold your orders for you and i can't tell you how much is going to be available i can't tell you when it's going to be available but let's just roll with it and see when everything rocks up and gets processed and we'll go from there all right thanks guys bye